inspired your collection? Um, so my collection was inspired by ocean sustainability and um, we're, we're polluting the ocean so much and there's so many big businesses out there that just don't care. Um, so I was inspired by using sustainable fabrics. I actually created my own textiles. Um, so I was able to use those textiles to create a very um, aquatic feel. Um, so my, my collection was kind of like mermaid-y, but um, it was kind of tongue-in-cheek mermaid-y. Like. Um, but I was really inspired to help those who um, have the ability to be in the limelight to shed light on very important issues, especially with sustainability in the ecosystem. And so you won Collection of the Year, so were you, were you expecting to win that or did it come as a surprise? It wasn't a complete surprise to me. Um, I had talked with um, a previous winner before, he had actually won a few times, um, and he told me at the beginning of the school year that if I was able to keep my work up and really continue doing the work with my fabrics, that I could do it. Um, and you know, up to that very last second, I had my fingers crossed, um, but I still had in the back of my mind like, don't be heartbroken if you don't get it. But I'm, I'm very, very excited to be able to say that I, I had the collection of the year. So what was your hardest part about putting your collection together? Oh goodness, the hardest part of putting my collection together was actually creating the fabrics. Um, so I created about 20 yards of fabric by hand um, throughout this whole process. Um, and you know, being able to get those fabrics to cooperate the way that I wanted them to. Um, some of them I didn't completely get to work the way I wanted and even like fitting those fabrics to models. Um, at the last minute I actually had to swap some of my models around, um, but it all really came together and I'm super excited that it, it looked wonderful out there.